You have the cells for the machine. They ought to provide enough power to lift that boulder. There we go. Now be careful facing that monster lurker at the top. Wait! Uh, I'll stay here and protect Kira. Jack, I think you're ready to handle that monster without me. Oh, really heroic of you.
I always wonder if I'm losing body parts in those things. Holy yakow! The Red Sage's lab looks worse than the Blues. Well, it definitely looks as though there's been a struggle here. <laughs> I'd hardly call it struggle. Would you, dear sister? Certainly not. The Red Sage gave up with so little effort. No fun at all. Gull? Is that you? You've finally gone off the deep end, eh? And Maya, I told you the Dark Eco would affect you both. Mm, nobody ever listens to old Samos. What have you two done with the Blue and Red Sages? Don't worry about your colorful friends, you old fool. They're perfectly safe in our citadel. Our special guests. They have graciously agreed to help us on a little project. You are wrong, Samos. Dark Eco can be controlled. We've learned its secrets, and now we can reshape the world to our liking. You can't control Dark Eco by itself. Even the precursors. Until now, we've do. had to scrape by with what little Dark Eco we could find near the surface. But soon, we will have access to the vast stores of Dark Eco hidden deep underground. Not the silos! Yes! The silos. They will be opened, and all the dark ego of the world will be ours! But that's impossible! Only a precursor robot- Oh, don't look so upset, Samos. We've got big plans for you. <laughs> Was Gull the same Gull who's supposed to change me back? Gull is the guy trying to kill us? I'm doomed. We may all be doomed. If they open the silos, the Dark Eco will twist and destroy everything it touches. We simply must get to their citadel to stop them. The fastest way there is through the lava tube at the bottom of this crater. A few more power cells and your Zoomer heat shield should get you across the lava safely. All right, my boy. You know what to do. Take the flea bag and go round up more power cells. Great balls of eco. There seems to be a large lurker presence in the spider caves. Great. Sounds like a real cheery place. Let me guess. There are spiders in the spider caves, right? Of course there are spiders in spider caves. But that's the least of your problems. The lurkers are after crystals of concentrated dark eco. You've got to destroy the crystals before those monsters get their hands on them. Up to it! Mm, dark eco's powers cannot be controlled. Oh my! Gordy, duh, I think we got visitors. You think, Willard? Howdy, strangers. Uh, passing through? Uh, us too. Well, we gotta be moving on. Nothing to see here. Duh, I thought you said this was a priceless gem worth Willard! Actually, we want power cells, not gems. We got four of them. Duh, you want them? What Birdbrain here is trying to say is, we may have a few power cells laying around, and we might be willing to part with them for 90 orbs each. Where have I heard that before? Hey, how do you two geniuses expect to get that big gem out of here anyway? Well, smarty pants, we got 12 more years of digging to figure that out. Uh, Gordy, wouldn't it take less time if you dug too? Oh, all right already. Here's a power cell for those orbs of yours. Oh, all right already. 
Here's a power cell for those orbs of yours. Oh, all right already. Here's a power cell for those orbs of yours. Why don't you two make yourselves useful? Lurkers have been excavating the dark caves over there. Seems they're looking for precursor artifacts. They can have the artifacts for all I care. For all we care? Well, it feed you, bird. All I care about are gems. But I ain't gonna be able to get the cave's gems, because when they're through, they're gonna collapse the place. If you take out the lurkers chewing at the support beams, you could save the cave for me. Now beat it! Hey guys, by my calculations, it's going to take 72 power cells to fuel the heat shield against the lava on the way to Gaul and Maya Citadel. Hmph! <laughs> 